Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. Today I am doing a new um, read. It is, um, you can be any sign that you are, but uh, the energy being read will be for your ex, Sagittarius. So if your ex is Sagittarius moon, rising, sun, or Venus, this reading is for you. Um, I'd appreciate it if you guys would all comment um, down below whether you want me to keep doing this reading or not. Um, that way I know whether you guys are enjoying it or or would rather me do something else. Also, make sure you uh, like the videos for your sign because that is how I uh, decide what videos are going to be posted in what order. So I want to thank you guys all for coming to my channel once again, and we will get started. Spirit and Angels, what messages do you have for me? Energy of ex Sagittarius in the collective. What messages do you have? Whoa, way too many. Well, geez. Someone's a little stuck because that did not want to come out. Okay. We have the Knight of Cups, the Knight of Swords, the Ace of Swords, the Star, the Eight of Swords, Judgment, Oops. Wow. Your Sagittarius has some amazing energy going on. The Queen of Cups is at the bottom with the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Wands. So they're getting ready to move away from an energy that is um, very exhausting to them. Um, put a lot, of, uh, a lot of question in their mind, a lot of weight on their shoulders. And they are getting ready to move forward in a different direction. I'm going to clarify each row here with the uh, Tarot of Sexual Magic. So, All right. Bottom of the deck, Hierophant. The top of the, the next card on this one was a Hierophant as well. So, okay, you're Sagittarius. Um, they are... They are deciding what their next move is. They're deciding uh, which direction to move forward um, to offer to offer the oh what is the word I'm looking for yeah yeah they're um. Yeah, they're just really trying to get all their emotions into words is what I am seeing. Um, you know, this is uh, a very good looking, um, handsome, you know, strong knight that travels in an amazing, beautiful land where the if you see the waterfall in the back, that's um, signifying his emotions. Um, he raises his cup in greeting as he passes. So yeah, this person, he's a knight in shining armor, really. Um, or woman in shining armor, I guess. Um, they are your, they're your knight in shining armor. They're your prince. They're your Cinderella coming back with the glass slipper. Um, yeah, his, his cup of love is just, it is overflowing overflowing with desire that he has for you. Um, he really has the power to move any obstacle in his way, any, whether it be by land, sea, anything. Um, he has the power to, to change or to move anything that is blocking the path to you. So, um, 
the only thing that the Sagittarius is wanting or needing is to be willing to give as much love as they are in return, to give an equal give and take of, of passion, love, romance, um, because they are very, they're a very romantic person. Um, and yeah, yeah, they are, they are preparing to move forward and give this cup to you. They just want it to be so perfect when they come back into your life that it's taking them longer than what a usual, um, fire sign night would. Yeah, with the the next card you have is the Knight of Swords. So, um, you know, in this card, they are riding through the storm clouds. They are rushing forward without thinking. Um, yeah. They put a lot of emotional concerns that they have in the back seat until they get to the point where it's just too much. Um, yeah. You know, their first impulse is to argue with you, to rush in, to take over, to, um, to create a, a solution because they know best. Um, they're very impulsive. Yeah, very impulsive. So, I mean, you put the two together and they're going to come back very quickly after I just said that they're taking their time. They're taking their time up to this point, but now that they know that it's safe to offer you back their love, their cup, they're going to come in very quickly, very impulsively. Um, but be cautious because it could be kind of a my way or no way type of, um, energy that comes towards you, but this will be one of success. It's, they're going to come in very, they're getting clear minded, crystal clear what they want. You see the crown above the sword, which signifies success, royalty, riches. They're going to come back or you to them, but no matter what, this relationship is going to be based on, um, a foundation of truth. Um, there could have been some, some things in the past that were very uh, foggy, that were uncertain, that you weren't sure why. Um, and they're going to come clear that all up. They are manifesting you or you to them back into, into fruition, back into the 3D. This is something that either you are to them or Sagittarius is to you. But whatever the case, this is manifesting very rapidly. Um, Sagittarius is... Uh, this Sagittarius X, they are wishing and hoping for you. They are um, pouring their heart out and hoping to the universe that they're going to bring you two back together. Because right now they're kind of feeling stuck. They're um, they're physically feeling stuck. Yeah, but the universe is going to step in. They are going to um, hand out judgment. They are going to give this relationship a second chance. Um, yeah, the, the karma has all been dealt with here. So the universe is going to step in and there will be um, a intense uh, getting back together, <laughs> um, a reunion, I guess you could say. Uh, that's going to make you so happy, so pleasurable, so sexually um, electric that it's amazing. But the universe is stepping in to help them get out of the stuck feeling because you are their wish. Um, they have the six of swords in the next row, but in this deck, they are arriving to smoother waters together. Here they're setting out in rough um, sees here they are arriving at their destination still with the boat intact both cups unspilled there is some emotional things that you guys will have to get through but what couple doesn't the 
the important thing is, is you guys arrive together in the same boat without it being destroyed or your cups being spilled. So Sagittarius X's, they are making a choice. They're no longer going to um, fight this battle alone. They're going to arrive at smoother waters and ask you to take them back. They are going to arrive very quickly, but very heartfelt back into your world because this is what they wished for. This is what you both wished for because you guys are soulmates. You've known each other from this life and lifetimes before you would do anything to get to each other. And you have the two of swords in the reverse again down here. So both of you are making the conscious choice to move back towards each other, um, to allow this six of cups, um, relationship to be, to have a new start, to be clear on what it is from the universe you want. And they are wishing and hoping for you. I do see them moving towards you in the next six weeks. Um, if you're Sagittarius or if your ex is a Sagittarius, Yes, I do see them moving towards you in the next six weeks. They are going to get out of this stuck feeling because the universe is going to help them within the next um, couple weeks of this um, with all the planetary shifts and the, yeah, all the planetary shifts, all the eclipses, that's going to push them out of the stuck feeling. They're going to make a choice and the choice is going to return to their soulmate. Angels, what messages do you have for those watching their ex Sagittarius? We love cross watchers, don't we? Woo! Heart to heart conversations. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other, and your bottom of the deck is very soon. Clearly decide what you want so it comes to you now. Like I was saying with the judgment, let the universe know that this is what you want. But they're going to reach out to you. And um, that is when you need to let them know how much they mean to you. How much you um, want them to return. Just honestly and openly discuss what your feelings are. And they will reciprocate. They will, um, which they haven't been doing lately. So this is a big move, a big shift for them with this energy um, of the eclipses. It's really helping them put one foot in front of the next. So I hope you guys enjoyed your cross watchers reading for your ex Sagittarius. I hope um, you guys return. Make sure you um, comment whether or not you want me to keep doing it. Uh, and like if you enjoyed watching. So thank you once again for coming to my channel. And until next time, I send you love, light and God bless.